Hello, welcome back. Steel Pinnings here once again, and today I have a standard stock, but it feels like it's got a ton of spools. Um, but that doesn't mean that it's not supposed to have them either. There's the key bidding. Let's see. Where, oh, there we go. And if we count them up, there. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven seven pins so this is a seven pin lock and we're gonna see if we can get it open so we can look inside because i want to see inside of it i got this lock a long time ago at least a year ago i got the back off of it already to make it easier it's got one of them clamp on things anyway i got it oh well over a year ago and I really haven't played too much with it, but if you look here, it's a lot bigger than a standard cylinder. A lot bigger, really. Even the face side, still bigger. So, I was like, is that a mogul? Holy cow, but no, it's not a mogul. We know what those things look like, right? We got one of those monsters right here, and it's a little bit bigger. And what I did with this one, this one, sorry, is I took the cylinder out of it and put a V10 cylinder in it. Quite nasty. So, uh, if anybody has one that they don't have keys for, I have one more key that I'm trying to get rid of that'll fit them, as well as I can turn any of these uh, regular cylinders, as long as it's an ASA, the top pins chambers will line up with the core. So I can modify the core to fit into those. But now that that being said, we're going to move on with getting this thing to turn. All right, I'm back to zoom. Here we go. Lucy, Lucy. Got a little click out of one. Click out of three. Two and three's loose, four's loose, five click, six loose, nice five loose, six is all the way at the bottom, get underneath it, gotta click out of seven, and just gonna roll, rumble my way back down, gotta click out of four, I believe, three dropped us in a nice set, two. Feel set. Get underneath it. One, giving us some counter rotation. And got it set. Three, tiny bit of counter. Kind of loosen up tension and kind of rake it a little. There we go. On again, set. Looks like four. Bounce on it and light tension, hopefully, and get it to. Getting past all these spools typically isn't a big deal when you got. There we go, and then back into our false set. When you have so many of them, set one. That's when it becomes a problem. Seven set. To five. Let off the tension until something drop. Add through and touch each one. Uh, 
Nice deep all set. And we're open. Makes for a fun little challenging lock. It's a get out device. Here, Ooh, I'm gonna push it out of my hand. Got this tray that I got from my buddy Trickmaster. Kind of line that up. Grab a. Oh, this one's slightly bigger. The standard you typically use for quick set is a little small. Uh huh. Looky there, looky there. It looks like this thing was master pinned. Or, I'm sorry, construction pinned. Has little construction balls there. Mm -hmm. See if we can dump those out. Little bitty pebble beads. Standard, standard. Boy, those are long. <laughs> Boy, this thing will make a mean challenge lock, huh? They almost look like they are beveled. Kind of like a, a lock would. Let's see here. See that bevel to it? It's not like a quick set bevel. That's pretty cool. Looks like all of them are like that. Pretty nifty. Even the small, shorty ones. It's pretty cool. They're all beveled as if they're lockwood bottoms. And the core, there's nothing done to it. Let's look at these top ones and see what's so special. I'm pretty sure we're going to find some spools. Yep. Holy cow, that one's deep. Yeah, that's a homemade school. Yeah, I was saying before. That's weird. That's kind of homemade too. As I was saying before, I got this lock a long time ago from a um, good picker buddy. Um, Mr. Ah, dun, dun. Right there. Um, pin tickler, no, uh, pin picker, <laughs> pin, tickler. pin picker, he's an English bloke, one hell of a guy, great little picker, now, I haven't seen him around for a while, but that doesn't mean much for us guys, I'll sign off with that big beefy little monster here, as you can see all the drill protection in it too, it's a monster. Um, y'all please stay safe, always stay legit. If you like this video and like what I do here, hit that like button. And if you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. And as always, until we meet again, peace.